was certainly okay. We're, we're listening to fucking soul Ken Dashow this Sam morning. Point. Okay, Breakfast with the Beatles. You know, it's good because I'll tell you, he picked some good songs in a row this morning, John. Uh, before we get into the, anything else, yes, I, I, ha, we all know I want to hold your hand, right? We know that song really well. Uh, it's a really popular Beatles song. <laughs> <laughs> Well, uh, in fact, I even covered it on my last studio recording. I did a a pretty Roy Orbison, Roy Orbison sort of inspired uh, version of that, and um, and John told me afterward, yes, I Roy Orbison was very much a, an inspiration, but he also said, um, Lena, you were my inspiration for that song. You were the whole reason I wrote that song. Mm-hmm. And, um, <laughs> it was like I, I had never heard that song before when he told me that, you know, mm-hmm. suddenly it was just a brand new song and it was just this unbelievable song. But so what's the point? I just uh, felt like seeing you cry this morning. Oh, shut up. Oh, Yeah. And then he follows it up with they then Dashow follows it up with help. Uh, aside from all the sentimentality, obviously here right now, mm-hmm. John's vocals were never cleaner or brighter than on those two recordings. Mm-hmm. Those would encapsulate John at his most extremely confident, powerful vocal ability. Uh, help, and I want to hold your hand, wouldn't you say? I mean, obviously, twist and shout, obviously. You know, don't I belong on the radio and not fucking dash out? Ab- absolutely and without a doubt. You should be on that show. You should be doing Breakfast with the Beatles. You are doing Breakfast with the Beatles. This is this is Breakfast with the Beatles, Lena. You, not dash out. You, I could listen to you. Christopher, could you not listen to her uh, elocute uh, and, and give her opinions? Really, couldn't, could, doesn't it just, couldn't you listen to that all day? Yeah, I check out that show. I check out that show. She's the most wonderful speaker, really. Well, you're very good. 24-7, baby doll. All right, here we go. <laughs> Here's where things go into the toilet. Anyway, we have to take the, we Before things go any further, Lena is in a blue funk today, and that will not do. Is that why you wanted to be pointed by this? The, well, the paint, the blue painting helps. It does. I'll tell you, Christopher has... Nice so, to see you again. Oh yeah. <laughs> John's is looking at you in the in the camera. That's funny. That's funny to you. I like the way my head is like balanced right on your forehead. It's it looks very nice on film. All right, well before bus- we're all business this morning. We're all business. We have to go right into business. Uh, this is breakfast with the Lennons. Who I don't really care about the Beatles right now. Lena, you promised me a song. All right, we did not rehearse this one yesterday, and so we must do it now. Do I need drums? Ugh. It's hardly a hardship, right? All right, you. It kind of is. Yeah, sure. All right. Da, 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 da. We're not in trouble again. I don't believe it. I can't conceive it. We're not in trouble again. Happy days are on their way. Happy days for you and me, baby. Not in trouble again. We're not in trouble again. Ah, uh, there I said it. I don't regret it. We're not in trouble again. No, oh, John. See, we're not in trouble again. Oh, there I said it. I don't regret it. Sunny skies are beaming down, and our feet won't touch the ground. Happy day, yes, are in our grass. 
baby, not in trouble again. I used to think the world was after me, one big catastrophe after the next. But who in fucking hell can live that way? So let's be bright and gay, not nervous wrecks. We're not in trouble again. Oh, so just accept it and just embrace it and baby face it uh, we'll just replace it uh, where enemies become friends the good time simply won't end we do it all over again cause we're not no in trouble again see that ending I right we, we almost got it so just accept it to, 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 and, to, and to, to just accept it to, 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 and just embrace it to, 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 uh, baby face it to, 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 we'll just replace it to, 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 where enemies become friends the good time simply won't end we'll do we do it all over again cause now we're not in trouble again boom right mm. but you see it has to be you can't miss a day well you know you know what i'm thinking yeah two a day two a day is, and if we can guess fit a whole set list in but two a day we have to and and rotate. It's got to be. You rotate. And I see what you're doing. You want me to write a fourth song. What's this one going to be? Oh, God, you're going to do this to me today? When am I going to play the xylophone when you write the full song? What's the name of the fourth song? Oh, Baba's Fat Ass is Outside. That's the name of it. Blah. Well, well, your fat ass is by that window. Oh, let's see if we can get a good shot of him here. Booba. He's the Mr. Booba. Hey, Booba's on film. The plant is, uh, oh, we got him. Isn't he gorgeous? Mm. A golden ray of sunshine. Booba. Come in. I know you can do it. Chris, show him how to get in. Oh, Aww, he looks sad. Boopa. He's fat. That window scares him. He trusts it. Oh, is he coming? No, he left. No, he's trying to get up the bravery. He feels confident when Christopher holds it open for him, but he he's worried about getting trapped in it. I know that's how he feels, but come on, Bobby, you can do it. <laughs> <laughs> come on, Boopa. See, he needs encouragement always. He's a real, he's a real baby. Come on, Booba. John, isn't he cute? I love that cat. No, there he goes. Now he'll come. You know what? He likes it when it's coming in. Like, look at this cat. Isn't he gorgeous? Hi, Booba. Ah, that was fun, wasn't it? Mm. You can do that yourself, you know. The cat's very wild, really. Mm -hmm. what I think he's our oldest adoptee. Maybe. Mr. Fun was about the same age when we adopted Mr. Fun. A couple of years old. Who's your favorite cat, John? Oh, I don't have a favorite. I love them all. I do, too. Even Crazy Maisie. Oh, it's her most of all, good God. <laughs> <laughs> the old bitch. So, you you think I'm in a blue funk today? I think you should put that brick under your head. I don't think so. I think it's a bad move. You might be right. That's all I need is a spinal cord injury, John. You're not going to get a spinal cord. Yeah. What do you think? I'm setting you up for the big fall, kid? I thought I already took the big fall. My point exactly. All right, so what's what's going on today? Well, that was good. That was fun. That was great. Mm -hmm. See what the idiots got on. All right. Who dash out, right? Who else? Mm -hmm. 
I lost the radio. It's gone. Oh, it's right here. What's the idiot doing now? It seems so brutal, but I don't care. He went a 4.3 New York's classic rock. Suddenly Eric Clapton walks in the room. And what's, what song is this? Suddenly <laughs> <laughs> so Eric Clapton walks in the room. Everybody dropped their drawers and shit in their pants. <laughs> <laughs> He's such an idiot. Sorry, George. It's all right. I understand that they'll take you off YouTube for that. I know. They'll mute the whole oh, vid. Right. It's such a fucking pain in the ass. But George, that's a good song, you know? Yeah. You play good guitar on that. Shut up. <laughs> this is my relationship with George, John tells me. They fight like cats and dogs. How and George, really, he's been so polite, right? That's the opinion I'm getting, because now lately, he's been saying these outlandish things to me, just like, what is wrong with you? <laughs> I'm just saying it with such disdain. It's like, why does George talk to me like I'm like, fuck you, George. And John's like, ah, things are going back to normal. So that was always my relationship with George. No, no. Well, one of great love, but real, a real, he's like a real little brother to you, you know, in so many ways. Mm -hmm. That's so funny. And he's like a nasty little brother. Yeah. It's funny. He's perfect. Um, so, yeah, want to hold your hand, those lyrics and everything. It was so beautiful, John, and, and put in that context of, well, I would like you to say what you said to me about it. I could always channel her and I could feel her and talk to her the way, you know, the way it is. And, and at the time that I wrote that song, it was just like, that's all I want to do is walk down the street holding your hand. I just want that, you know, that's what I want. And I want the world to see me walking down the street holding your hand. And I just want that so badly. Mm -hmm. Mylena. Mm-hmm. It's funny, I feel the same way. Like, why can't everyone else just see him? Why is it why is it like this? Mm -hmm. But um then it always comes around to who cares? Who cares if everyone can see it? Like, what is that good has that ever done me? Like in my life, like I don't know. I guess it's the natural inclination to want to be recognized or want approval for something, but what am I looking for approval for? I'm with John Lennon. Like, that's the question I ask myself, but I know that's not it. Mm -hmm. I know that's not it. It's just, it's, this is the weirdest situation. Yeah. Uh, well, I would think that it's pretty obvious. Yeah. Look up at that skull up there. I'm looking at it. Can you get it in the camera? Yeah, kind of. It's not that good, though. Forget it. It goes to hell when you try to do the camera, John. It really does. Hmm. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. Mm. You know what you should do today, I'll tell you? You should find... No, don't do that. No, you change your mind awfully quickly. Um, I think we could find... But I mean, keep it until the next show. All right. Don't say anything. Right. By then you'll forget it. So this was a mistake. <laughs> Mr. Mr. Wake and Bake. Yeah. So, uh... Yeah, you know, so that, that song, I Want to Hold Your Hand, it just really took on a whole different meaning. And I suddenly saw it through John's eyes as a young man in love his whole life already with this phantom girl that no one else can see. Mm -hmm. well, I mean, look at these beautiful love songs that he wrote, really, and think about it, people out there. And I'm not just saying this like, yeah, he wrote these, this stuff for me. Wow. It's not that. It's that it all makes sense if you look at the lyrics to all of John's really gorgeous love songs. There is not one person that he could have written those to that was close to him in his life. He never wrote a song for Cynthia. She even said it. No, he never wrote a song for me. He never wrote a song for her. 
his first wife, the greatest songwriter in the fucking free world, never wrote a song for his first wife. Even an angry one. One of them came close, and that was Across the Universe, believe it or not. And that became a song to me. But John, I was arguing with Cynthia, and she was berating me for some kind of behavior around Julian. I don't remember what it was. And uh, for bringing people home or something, and I don't know. And then nonsense, and I was just in bed. We were in bed, and I was just, you know, trying, hoping for sleep, and that was never coming. And I just remember this, like, where her words don't stop. Will she shut up? Words are flowing like fucking, you know, this fucking muddy river, you know. And then all of a sudden, that song, I, I started drifting off to sleep, and that song came to me. Right. So I had to get up and write write it down. Words are flowing out in this rain into a, you know, it became pretty. Because you were helping me, of course. Mm. Me, yeah. The rain in the paper cup, the letter box. Always with letters. Mm. That's one song we should do. Gone, go get her. Gotta get going. I'm a little go getter. Like packing up an old out sweater. Mm. So, what are you thinking about the xylophone today? Um. See how your arm feels. Don't. It's there. We have a xylophone. All right. See how your arm feels. This is not a contest. No, and you're not copping out if you don't feel like overdoing it. Good God, don't do anything. All right. I need, You do need to hear that. Don't do a fucking thing. All right. Chris, you hear that? John doesn't want me to do a fucking thing. Right. Chris likes that kind of advice. <laughs> don't you? You love that advice. Oh, well. Ah, I wonder how things are up at the cabin. They're lovely. How else would they be? They're gorgeous. It's beautiful up there. It's a beautiful world, Lena. I know. It's beautiful in here. Is it? It is. It's fantastic in here. Hi, Bob. Hey. Bob and Dylan is here. They're all here. Um, Joe. Mm. Elton. Oh, Freddie, I heard that. Thanks for that song this morning. Yeah. Why don't you put on another Beatles song? All right, Fred. Find me somebody to love. Somebody, somebody, somebody. Find me. All you have to do. Five million commercial song show sucks. Somebody, find me somebody to love. So, Fred, yeah. What's a good word? You looking around my room, what are you looking at? Just thought, I don't know. I think it, nah, no, we won't go there. All right. Are you trying to design right now? I'm just thinking about what you were thinking about the other day, and it would be good, but it's, it's not really important. It's not of consequence. It's just whatever it is. Mm. These guys helped me design the room. You want to do a song before we go out, John? Um, yeah, I do. Want to do one of the other ones? From It's Not In Trouble. Oh, let's try to fight the fourth one. All right. My friend Trouble. <laughs> well, it's better than Trouble is my friend. Trouble is my friend. Yeah, you don't want that. But my friend Trouble kind of sounds kind of sneaky. Yeah. I like it. All right. Okay. What do you got? I got some kind of, I got, I got right now in my mind, I got Sinatra leaning on a lamppost. So bear with me. Mm. Uh, you're giving me something that it almost sounds oh, a little on going toward old man river, but not quite. 
my friend trouble i like it um go down instead of up because with old man river be my friend trouble so we go where it is not obvious and really weird okay <laughs> and that is our first line. So this has got to be the the hook line in Cinco. Yeah. Because once they're in that, then they don't come out. You just <laughs> go in, underneath the sea level. Right. My friend trouble. Getting closer. My. It's got to swing a little bit more. Ch -ch -ch -ch. My friend trouble. No. <laughs> <laughs> Folks, this is the fucking process. Mm. My friend trouble. No, it's gonna it's it's way too dirty. No, no, we gotta have a, a, a good one like that uh, that becomes a fucking barn burner. I'm telling you, let's just stay with this thought, Bob. Uh, nah, don't go for, go don't go to me for this. Why not? Why not, Bob? You like those Sinatra songs? Give me give me some kind of riff here. Mm. Before you started this, I was thinking of that song. Uh from one of those chorus lines or something. How can I be sure? That's like the, that's the new rascals, the young rascals. All right. In a world that's right, constantly, right. oh God. I, I, I was thinking of some other song, one of the Broadway ones, but I was thinking like a, like a, a ballad or something or a quieter one. Yeah, right. It's got to be like we got to bring it to a new place in the in the musical. You know, you, right. the way they, the, it's like riding a wave. You see. <laughs> the ebbs, the flows, the nuances. Let's go, Bob. Bob, Tom. I'm terrible with that. No, you're good with that. Come on, my sister got lucky. Lou. Mm. I almost, I almost could, I could tell you, I almost got something for you. Yeah, don't worry about him. No? <laughs> I knocked the rat out of your head. Sorry. Hold on, Lou. Hold on, Lou. <laughs> Lou, 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 Lou. Mm. Uh, uh, how about, well, what, what did you, how about instead of, you know, that'll come later maybe, but uh, why don't you try a, why don't you try a punk underground version of it? Like, you know, just try a whole different, get out of that riff and. Use that for something else. All right, that's not a bad idea. So what do you got in mind for my friend Trouble? Okay. <laughs> I hear it already in Lou's head. Mm -mm. Uh, my friend Trouble is a pretty good guy. <laughs> Um, uh, uh, yeah, something he'll always look you in the eye. Yeah. Mm. My friend Trouble, he's a pretty good guy. Da, 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 da. And this, Lynn, I, yeah, I could do the xylophone. Mm -hmm. Easy peasy, man. Fucking two chords. All right, right. Lou fucking Reed. <laughs> My friend Trouble. Take it, Lou. Let's go. We got a few minutes left here, Felton. My friend Trouble, he's a pretty good guy. One thing you can say, he'll always look you in the eye. My friend Trouble. My friend Trouble. My friend Trouble. <laughs> Um, 
Never picks up the tab. Dun, 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 My friend Trouble always out for the grab. Dun, 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 My friend Trouble, yeah. Dun, 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 dun. My friend Trouble, yeah. Dun, 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 dun. So far, so fucking good, Lou. Mm. So far, so very velvet, yeah. That was heavy. Yeah, that was great. Joey wants in. Yeah, Joe, I can hear you wanting in. All right, yeah. I'm going to take the middle eight. All right. I don't know what I got yet. All right. Got to whip that xylophone. You guys tricked me. You got to whip that xylophone out and I'll give you something good. All right. Joe, you should have played the xylophone at fucking CB's. You should have had one of them motherfucking things strapped to your neck. Yeah, right? Probably would have broke my back. Nah, you'd be all right. I'm telling you, Joe, you'd have been great doing that. Yeah, I know. 2020, right? 2020, Joe. Ain't it the truth? John's just he's wanting to bust out laughing. He's like, he's like these kids from Queens listening to them go. All right, we got to hear this song. What's next on the fucking douchebag show? Yeah, he's kissing Ringo's ass this week because uh, <laughs> Ringo's got on tour. Yeah, right. He does that with them guys. Yeah, the living... The living, yeah. World of the living, oy vey. Right. You guys tell me, uh, from the crossed over crowd, naturally. Elton, I want you to weigh in, too. What's what's the weigh in? Better down here or out here? No fucking doubt about it. Do we sound at all upset about anything out here? No. You don't. And you all make fun of me all the time for worrying all the time. Yeah, because you're insane, but you're still down there. Elton, do you worry about anything? Yeah, like when it's... Like what? When it's all over, this mess. Yeah. And you see that as being sometime soon. Elton, this is Elton John? Yeah, it is. Mm. Debbie Harry's here too. Mm Mm-hmm. We all have to march up to that day, right? Hey, Debbie. Hey. That day's marching up to you. Don't worry about it. You got no, you got no marching to do. You sit down and have a seat. <laughs> that sounds good, though, doesn't it? Yeah, it does sound real good. Don't worry about it thing, all right? Don't sweat it. Don't sweat it for that guy, either. He's all right. He's telling me John Van Bergen's okay, Lou. That's good. Give him my best, yeah. So, uh, I guess that's it. We've been on... This is a long film. All right. You ready to go? Yeah. All right. Well, love to Mother and Father God. Love to the brethren and the home team. Big love to the punk rock kids. Fucking uh, Joey and, uh, and Lou. Listen, so you want to finish that... Fi- write some more on that xylophone. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. All right. Um, doesn't matter. Got all day. All right, Johnny. Happy Sunday. Happy Sunday to you, honey. You all right? Yeah, I want some coffee, though. Happy Sunday, Christopher. Hey, yo. Yeah, happy Sunday, Chris. Hope happy you have Sunday. a great day today. Thanks so for making. So thanks for making us a coffee. Anytime. Yeah, that'll be good. All right, we're going to have our iced coffee. Mm. Anytime. I love you, Johnny. I love you, too. I want to hold your hand. I'm hot. He, the thing is, he holds my hand all day. Mm. He, like, grips my hand, both of them sometimes, and he just grips them. Mm. And he's been doing it for years. Mm-hmm. Never realized what it was. I thought I had a spasm, always, that, that would get worse. Mm. But it was John. Quite amazing. What are you telling me about Twitter? I don't want you staying on there today. I I hate that platform. All right. I I mean I I we'll do whatever posts we need to do. But then don't 
don't surf. All right. All right. No problem. I won't go on it at all. All right. Deal. Deal.